Hey everyone, what's going on? Phoenix here, bringing you another Asheron's Call gameplay video. Today we are doing the Undead Slayer quest. We are starting in Fion Outpost. Uh, we're going to talk to Fion Lyil, and then we're going to head to Lytlethorpe to start the very quick flagging process to do this quest. Alright, Devana Portal is this one. And from here, we're going to run to New Madeira's mansion, New Madeira's dungeon. All right, so this is New Madeira's mansion. We're going to head inside, and there's like a basement that you can go into, and uh, you know, the, the same kind of like housing portal that you would go into normally, except it's it's a dungeon. Madeira's dungeon. Just make sure we're all here. Then you want to go in, uh, head through, and you're looking for a bookcase, which I think is on the far wall. It's in here somewhere. Bookcase. There you go. It's going to portal you again into another section of the dungeon which is kind of cool. I like when they do stuff like that. Then you're going to need to go down all the way to the bottom and there's going to be crates. Storage crate. They're all over the dungeon. When you destroy them, they explode and they have a chance to drop a blue face paint recipe. So we're going to grab that. Everybody in your fellowship who does this needs to grab one. And then what I like to do is just kind of gather in the middle once you have one. And from there, uh, we're going to go back to Fionn Lyil and hand him the recipe. So you just hand him the face paint recipe. He reads it and basically flags you for the next dungeon, tells you the coordinates to the temple entrance. The best way that I know to get there is to use a Zelda Sets portal gem. All right, so now that I have my Zelda Sets portal gem, we're just going to pop in. This puts you about four clicks away. I think it's the fastest route. You can also go to Arwick and then run to the Dagger Vale settlement portals. All right, and then you're at the temple entrance. You can just pop in. This is restricted to 120 or greater. All right, from the drop, we're going to just make sure everybody gets in. All right, we got everybody. And we're just going to hug left. Going down. There's a lot of Sclavis in here. No need to clear any of this stuff. These guys are, well, maybe if you're level 120 doing it, try to do this solo. Um, linear path for most of this, I believe. And then we're looking for a patrician Kikiltaris or something. Names are hard. Names are very hard. <laughs> This is it, Patrician, oh, Patrician Ferrix. I've got my Undead Slayer out. And 
you're gonna grab East Temple Key. The East Temple Key is going to unlock this door here, which has a lever which you're gonna pull, which opens this door here. And then I believe this opens this door. gonna kill Patrician Kilkitris. This is the one that I thought I was looking for before. So it's Ferrix first and then Kilkitris second. You're gonna loot a West Temple Key. You're gonna use it on this door, and then you're gonna pull this lever. Now, when you pull that lever, it's gonna close this door, so it's best to have somebody there to hold it, and then it's gonna also open this door. You can run through, and we're at the boss, so Lunum. There are two prerequisite quests for this. Lunum's Pyre, I think, is the first one. Yeah, Lunum's Pyre, and then Lunum's Disappearance. Um, you don't have to do those to do this quest, even though the wiki may say that you do. Two hundred thousand health, or is that twenty thousand? Yeah, two hundred thousand. It's nothing. kill on them and then everybody needs to loot a uh, key from the corpse there's a ton on the corpse so you can bring a large group however the frustrating thing with this quest is there's only one chest to loot uh, the rewards from so you just need to make sure that the chest closes and locks again before using the key on it so what I would recommend doing is just IDing this um, kind of constantly. So you're gonna loot from the chest Lunum's token, Fionn crown, and the black skull of Zixma. You can hand Lunum's token to Fionn Lyil for 100 million experience. You can hand the Fionn crown if you don't want it to Fionn Lyil for 23 million experience. And if you don't want the black skull of Zixma, which is the undead slayer item, you can get another 23 million experience. So if you're just bringing people along, you can get 140 million experience. There we go. So we got the token, the crown, and the black skull, and then we're gonna head back to Fiona Outpost. And there we go, Tw uh, 24 million with the XP trinket, so. Yeah, that's gonna be it for this quest. I hope you enjoyed it. Undead Slayer is definitely a super useful thing to have. May even need more than one if you want like an AR fire and a regular fire end. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please press that like button. Please subscribe to the channel, and thanks for watching. Bye.